Well, first of all, so thank you very much, Mr. Venkat and Sridhar, for inviting me here for this uh, good evoking uh, Sunday morning for me, of course. Generally, we wake up a little late, correct? And uh, of course, uh, we wake up with different plans and all, but today, this, this has become my primary plan. And because he was my old friend also. And uh, thank you very much, Venkat. And I was uh, wondering that Venkat has started this and all at one time. But I know he is very dynamic and all. The other person who is supporting him, Mr. Sridhar, is also there. So, congratulations first of all. So, for a successful businessman in one direction here, I wish to come more and more successes to you in the next coming future first of all. And uh, coming to this, I have just gone through that uh, profile of this particular COE PD. So, I mean, I don't take much of your time. I know it will be boring if I take lengthy of stories and all, but I just want to keep the things short to see uh, more interactive and uh, see if you have any question that I can answer. Probably I don't say I'm perfect in all. There, no, man, no human being is perfect for sure. But let us see if I can interact with you for some time and uh, see. So the concept he has selected, I was just going through that. It's a business analyst. So how many of you are really aware of what is the intention of a business analyst? Please don't take me that time talking with, starting with a question in law. How many of you are really aware of this business analyst? Sorry? Feel free. See, no classroom lecture, please. Okay, sometimes I learn it for you from your uh, suggestions and all. So, starting from any of the projects, first we need to understand. Suppose if I am starting a simple project of a data science. What is that primarily required for that? I was heading the complete global uh, telecom media information services earlier. I just moved to other role recently. So now if I want to take and see how can I increase my reach. Say I am a telecommunication provider. So how do I increase the reach of my services? How can I get more and more acquisition of the customers? Okay, how do I, uh, I control the retention? Like what I mean by retention is attrition. Suppose if people are leaving and joining with some other companies and all, or some other service providers, how do I minimize that? So what data is required, that, are, that all depends on the business problem. If I'm talking about the people moving from one particular service provider to another service provider. So then we need to understand what was the profile of the earlier service provider, what is, why they are, people are moving here. That, uh, that is from the data perspective, infrastructure, data, from that perspective, the data is backbone for everything. But now when it comes to the, the, the intelligence of the people, it is the business analyst who drives the whole thing. Why? Because he should understand, so he should understand what is, what is my business problem. So what type of data is required for me to drive that analysis? How should I give some return on investment to the end service provider, end users of this particular service? So all these are properly defined by a business analyst. As I told you, it can be an IT project, it can be a data project, it can be analytics project, or it can be a even BPO project. So you need to understand what is that it is required for that. So then only you will be able to I mean, uh, successfully drive the project. I have been to different countries, almost uh, around 16 countries for multiple times to interact with the customers. So when we go to the customer, we need to talk to their language, their technical language and their domain knowledge. If you don't understand the domain, suppose if I talk something technically and if you are uh, not able to understand, it doesn't make sense. The customer will start looking at me like this and after that he'll go away. He will not give any business. So, to get a business, you need to talk to them in their language to make sure that they understand that you got the complete understanding of their business, you know what is their requirement, so that is done by a business analyst. Okay, so I mean that is why whenever a new project comes, you can see that I need an unsure project, project manager, all these one part. But before to that, we need a business analyst who can understand the customer's pulse, who can understand the customer's culture. All these are driven by them. Then if, if you have a proper understanding and training and knowledge of this business analysis, data science. So data science, what is the, what is the data science here? Any idea? Management of data. 
Yeah, see, I'll, I'll give you a simple layman example. Earlier, when you are constructing a house, see, for carpentry work, one person used to come and do the carpentry. For plastering and all the cement work, and they used to do one other person, correct? Now, that time, it's an individual work. But there should be, now, everyone used to, but you are the person coordinating with all the people to get it done. Now, what is happening nowadays, you know some idea how it works. Okay, where to place the uh, proper pipelines, where to keep the proper electricity. See, because these are all different people who work for you to build your house. <laughs> now, here, a data scientist is the one who can understand the data, who can look into that and uh, uh, the understand the variables of that, and uh, the machine learning algorithm, what I was referring to, to understand that. And then, how do you implement that? Finally, when you productionize that, how do you productionize that? And what is the outcome that is getting? And see, if you consider P the, the industries like telecom, retail, and these, these things will not last for more time. If you see the mobile, so earlier, at one time, it was 2G, 2.5G. Now we are at almost nearing to the 5G, 5G technologies, correct? So if you, uh, there are certain things, like the mobile might not be supporting your services sometimes, the 5G. Or, uh, I mean, uh, there are different components to that. So, so what you need to do is, we need to understand what is the business problem, how do you bring it uh, to the table to make sure that you get the success in that table. So, all this will be driven by the business analyst specifically. Again, I'm repeating that. The reason being, see, if, you, if we don't get the proper understanding of the customer's data, customer's requirement, customer's uh, the BA landscape, all this, Finally, it will end up in a horrible situation. You will not get anything that is expected out of that. So, now, when I heard of this, what is the intention of this particular thing? I was, uh, when I was coming in the call, I was just going through that. So, then really appreciate that because people are starting trainings in uh, uh, data science areas. I am doing that uh, the Azure Cloud. So, but see, these are all next level of success. First level of success is, so for any project, we need to have a business analyst who understands that. that definitely other things are definitely important. If you don't have a proper plan to build the building, so how do you build that? I'm sure. I don't know. But, uh, definitely I could uh, uh, recollect that. But, uh, which is a very important point for attending and to get the interview calls. <laughs> that also is successfully taken. Third one is, so when people are getting demotivated, I heard some people, Calling personally and taking personal attention. Okay, so I was just recollecting his brother also, the same attitude. I don't know whether he is here, Bishop Sridhar, who is a very good friend of mine. Uh, so we used to work together in the similar way. I know he is very dynamic. Of course, he is really intelligent guy and dynamic. So some of the things I could see the similarity. And uh, so congratulations. I really feel that it will grow exponentially and this will become the best, okay? And uh, I'm really happy to hear such a great success stories from different people, from different uh, domains, different areas, uh, really. Congratulations to each one of you. I wish you all the best in your future for all of you.